In English, if a native speaker absolutely needs to do something, they're probably not going to say, I must do it. Instead, they'd probably just say, I have to do it. In spoken English, it's not very common to use must when talking about obligations because it sounds a bit formal and intense. So it's more commonly used when giving strong recommendations and informal writing. However, we do use must very often in spoken English when making suppositions or statements that we think are true based on the information we already have, but we don't know if they're true for sure. For example, you must be so tired after such a long flight and he must have been so happy to see you. But also, must can be used as an informal noun to refer to something that's very necessary. So for example, if you're going to New York City, visiting the Statue of Liberty is a must. And if something is a must have, it's something that you absolutely need to have in a certain situation. For example, a reliable laptop is a must have for any college student. Now practice using must like native speakers typically use it in the comments below.